Hi everyone, my name is Christopher Walker and today we're going to be talking about the toolbar option within Google Jamboard. So once you're in your new jam, you're going to notice on the left hand side there's this little column of different options and that's your toolbar. At the top you have your writing utensil option. So you have a pen, marker, highlighter, and brush option. And we're going to start with the pen and you'll also notice that you have six different color options so we'll go with black and when you draw you'll notice it looks very similar to what a pen or possibly a pencil looks like the next option is a marker and we'll change the color for this this one is slightly thicker than the pen option as you'll notice um, then you have a highlighter um, this one works just like a normal highlighter and you'll notice that if you go over a spot um, more than once it will start to get darker just like a normal highlighter would do and then you have your paintbrush option and we'll change the color again and this one almost looks more like watercolors um, and so you kind of have like a fainter thicker look to it then after that we have an erase option this allows you to erase parts or sections of um, your drawings or whatever you may be doing in Jamboard. You also have up here in the top um, a clear frame option and this will clear the entire like template or page. You have a select option so if you start to import images or sticky notes which we'll talk about in just a second you'll be able to move that with the select select option. You have a sticky note option which allows you to pick different colors and even a transparent sticky note. Um, and so you can start typing in different things. You can put words, phrases, all that sort of stuff. So we'll put like earth and then we'll click save. And you'll notice when you do that, it kicks out the sticky note, but it allows you to keep writing more in. So maybe I want moon um, and maybe you want different color. We'll put Mars and Venus. And then we'll click cancel and now we have our different sticky notes now you'll notice once you cancel it puts you right back in the select option so you can start to move these around you also have an image option um, so you can upload images from your desktop laptop whatever you're currently on you can do a google image search so you could search through images on google you can also pull some from your google drive or you can look through your recent files. So if you want to pick one, you can click it. It's only gonna allow you to put images in though. Um, so you'll notice that with my Google um, stuff, it's going to have this red box with a mountain type look. So I'll click select and it will put that image in. From there, I can shrink it, expand it, and then I do have an option to duplicate or delete. I also have a laser pointer option. So with this option, I can circle things, but you'll notice eventually it goes away. So I'm not actually making marks. I hope you enjoyed the short tutorial on the toolbar option within Google Jamboard.